Welcome back. <laughs> Sorry about that. Yeah, we really need to help with something real quick. So, Chrono Trigger. <laughs> Getting back into this day two. Ah, uh, had a lot go on last time. So, from what I recalled, I can get this clicking. Uh, let's go ahead and load. Okay, so last time we played. We were in the ruins. Played a lot. <laughs> now I think about it. Curly in the future. Thank you, Dumbo. Uh, we're playing as a character named Chrono. We met a girl named Marley. She had some pendant. We went back in time somehow. Uh, using Luca's uh, stuff, machine creation things. Uh, Marley got saved and then died. <laughs> Because we kind of messed with the past, which would have changed the future. Uh, saved Marley, brought her back to present day. Chrono got sent to trial. I failed my trial. Because I never talked to a freaking cat. Um, got arrested, fought a dragon tank. Uh, broke out of jail, went to the future. And we found out that the future gets destroyed by something named, I think it's called Lavos? And that's pretty much where we're at. We found out, oh, we got a bike. That was the thing, okay, yeah. We got a bike at the end of the street. Or some pass to a bike, I don't remember. But we got some type of bike. And that's where we're kinda just at right now. Okay, we have to go to, there's Primo Dome, Primo, Primo Dome. Yeah, that's pretty much where we're at. But yeah. Let's better recap of the game. <laughs> okay, so we have to go oh, to the right. I want to do what this is. Abandon the sewers? Uh, Eek, outsiders better report to Crawley. Should I be here? I think this is like optional. Or we're fighting either way. It'd be nice if it's just optional. They're kind of tough. I was wondering, I'm like, how much damage am I taking? 18 is not too bad. Got here. There was a bridge here. I saw it. I swear, Ribbit. Why well, it got up and walked away, Ribbit? Don't you lie to me. There's nothing here at all, Ribbit. Ribbit. <laughs> but it's true, Ribbit. Someone's coming. Let's scram, Ribbit. The <laughs> boss. <laughs> okay. How's it look the same? I wonder if it's like an optional little area. It's kind of cool. Okay. Let's... Can't move. This is a place a tad... This place is a tad on the spooky side. I've got a bad feeling about this. Should I be here? I'm a little worried. I'm like, should I be here right now? I don't like cats. Oh, you're a trap cat. Alright, that wasn't too bad. I think I just gotta get used to the fast pacedness. Is that a word? It's a word now. Uh, just getting used to the pace of the battles and everything. And once I get used to that, I'm good. Heal. 
kind of want to use some potions. I think I'm going to save up a little bit. This is a trap. Yep. <laughs> I think everything you interact with is going to be a trap. Uh, let's do... Okay, I'm going to do Cyclone here. This guy wanted to do Flame Roll, but I guess Cyclone will do. That wasn't too bad. I think I should have to have the weak ones. Just trying to get all the weakness. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. I should get my butt kicks. <laughs> A little bit. But we should be fine. I get these attacks off. Attacking Chrono though. Everyone leveled. For floral wind, Fl fire wind, world, birds, flare world wind. I am actually getting low on MP. No, I'm seeing that. I should get this one. Yeah. I heal Chrono again. A little banged up. Already? I was gonna say already. I save spot. <laughs> it's a little weird. All right, definitely gonna save up for Fire Whirl. Let's wait for it. Oh, really? Never mind. I was gonna say that's actually kind of a waste. It's fun. At least we killed it. Check what we got up here. Looks like trouble. Um, Chrono literally has four uh, MP left, so let's get a little bit, a bit up there. Let's really keep it like that for now. We're actually stocked up pretty well. Item wise, nice, nice. I wonder what happened with the bridges that they were talking about with those uh, frogs. Like, why they're out. Like, this one's fine. Oh, I'm on the other side. Cool. Oh, that's a switch. Right? No, it's just a wall. It's just a wall. <laughs> okay, it's the wall. Found the wall. Cool. Look like a switch. <laughs> Go over here. Oh. I'm lucky I found that. Oh, I've been so lost. Uh, looks like you just have to press the switch and the bridge will extend across, Ribbit. 
So switching on already, Ribbit. Let's see. Ribbit. Can't reach it, Ribbit. And you call yourself a frog, Ribbit. So what's coming? Let's scare him, Ribbit. Alright, Ribbit. Okay, uh, let's open this. Rage Band? It's definitely equipment. Grants 50% counter attack rate? I might prefer that over attacking, honestly. Whose attacked events can I control? Where? Reveals HP. Yeah, I like Rage Band. I like the ability to counter. If I get hit. That's a great ability. <laughs> Speed plus one. I think I'm gonna give Luke a power glove. We'll lose a little bit of speed, but now we got a little bit of power with her. Not much, but this is a little bit. Maybe she'd be better off with speed. I don't know. It's not a huge difference. There's three of them, and they're almost here. Watson through the sewers like they own the place, eh? Must have a death wish. We'll teach him a little respect. Yes, we will. He he he. Just let him come through here, they'll be chopped liver, pulverized. We'll even know what to call them when we're done. <laughs> All these he he's har hars. Uh -huh. Alright, we get it. <laughs> Relax. Like, oh, snap. Hmm. Like Dave realize. Did you throw me around? Wait a minute. Hold on. Oh damn. Okay. Wait. Chrono needs to heal big time. Just not expecting that. Oh my god, I 100% needed the heal there. Got the counter. Alright, let's do Fire Whirl. And I think I'm gonna heal Chrono again. Oh, well, that works too. Alright. Kind of felt like a mini boss. Like, that was actually kind of tough. Your XP, out. Got a bit. Uh, oh, I was like I say, I just hit the menu button. What's going on? I might move this. I don't know a lot battle. Did I know there was auto battle though? There we go. Wait, I'm trying to see the enemies here. I do actually appreciate that. You can kind of just move this around in case if uh, it's in the way. I'm guessing that should do it. Thunderblade? That's awesome. Alright, let's see. It's a big upgrade. Alright. Well, that's significant. It's good size. Alright, so I think this takes me back. Yep. Perfect. So now I can go back here if I need to. One day. Oh! What's this? Keeper's Dome? I honestly don't know where I'm going. I'm kind of just exploring. I do know where I need to go. 
fish. I'm just, I just want to take a scenic group. What is this place? None of this works, or it does? Power's out. Hello? Oh, wise one, I cannot wait to see what program code you will install next. Oh, now that's the story of appreciation that makes all my work worthwhile. How's the current one? Seems a little better than before, anyhow. Shala? Oh, I missed you so. No, you mustn't go to Death Peak. Wouldn't make it very any very far anyway. It has to be the right time and and it has to be them. Or the way is shut. Yes, yes. Say. <laughs> have you seen my masterpieces? The Ocean Palace and the Blackbird? I designed and built them both, you know. Fine works, wouldn't you say? Oh wow, this guy. What is this? <laughs> Just looks like an area I just can't go into right now. Like, I'm here too early. See Ocean Palace and other. <laughs> oh, Blackbird? Why well, know what that is? Like the monster looking creature? What Shala is? Don't go to Death Peak. Ocean Paws and Blackbird. Huh. Either way, I can't do anything. So. Can I just. Is there anything just around here? <laughs> I probably have to go back. But I'm kind of happy I got to explore like, at least a little bit. So there's nothing. Oh, this is Death Peak? Should I go? <laughs> I said not to, but you know, <laughs> curiosity. Oh, this is good. Help! Guess <laughs> I can't go to Death Peak. Okay. We'll come back maybe someday. All right, all the enemies are back, so I guess we'll beat them up again. It's good to know, though. I mean, there's like another little hidden area over here. I'm glad I explored it. I was thinking, like, I do kind of want to heal. Not in the worst place. Let's do it just in case. It's Marley. Like, I felt like it would be in much worse con con uh, condition, so I was like, eh. Almost. <laughs> I'm kind of curious if we can get on that end. On like the right side? I think I can somehow find that ladder and go across. I would probably have to redo this entire area again, but at least look at oh, I didn't see you. Can okay, I just focus on attacks? That wasn't too bad. Can I get over? Oh wait, I've already been over there. Alright, never mind. <laughs> yeah, I guess we're good here. <laughs> Interesting area. What's this place called again? Random abandoned sewers. I'd say random abandoned sewers. All right, cool. So we checked that area out. I think that was a nice little pit stop, though. It's like a little bit of experience and uh, I think a new weapon that's kind of nice. Thunderblade. I remember they mentioned this place that. <laughs> I think it was mentioned. Like go into this? Hmm. 
Hold it right there. Oh. Bro. Bro. <laughs> it's, it's his name actually, bro. Thanks for the intro, boys. Bro. Bro. You lowlifes can call me Johnny. Oh, okay. I was actually kind of excited if his name was actually just bro. I'm the leader of this pack. Now listen up. The ruined highway up ahead's the only road you've got. When we reach the other side, then you're going to have to ride in a race against me, that is. I'll let you use the jet bike, because that's the kind of guy I am. Don't sweat it, and don't you dare chicken out, babe. So, do you shiny axles know how to ride? <laughs> Alright, listen up and let Johnny tell you how it's done. Gas is on auto, so there's only one speed. Fast. To steer, just press up and down directional buttons. Uh, tap B for turbo boost, so I'll give you three of them. B icon show how many you've got left. Heads up though, after you use one, you can't use another until the gauge above the icons are refilled. You can check your position from the finish line on the screen. Show me what you got, babe. I'm so confused. Alright. Dude! That's actually kinda cool. So can I actually like get in front of you? Okay, I get the B part. But he goes fast. So I'm guessing I gotta stay in front of him. So I can only go up and down. Got it. He goes pretty fast. I think I wanna wait this. Wait, wait, wait for it, wait for it. Oops. I thought I had to cross the finish line there. <laughs> Bro, he's so fast. He came in dead last. <laughs> Give it up. Go home. Ha, oh, what a joke. If that's the best you can do, you can walk your way across the ruins. Better watch out for those monsters, though. Right again, if you think you can handle a chump. Guess I'm gonna walk. Can he actually walk? Oh. You know, I kind of want to walk. Don't get me wrong, this is fun. But... Alright, I guess I'll do the ride. I'm kind of curious what the walk actually gives you and how long it is. Oh, I didn't realize there's like a point thing. That actually makes sense. I got I missed that completely at the top left there. So on the bottom left there's a goal. No! I just missed it. <laughs> I'm trying to time the boost. That's the thing. But once you time the boost, you're fine. Like, let him get ahead a little bit, it's fine. I want to win the race. Alright, let's use one of our boosts. Oh, come on. There we go. I gotta have this. <laughs> Fun race though. <laughs> you beat me? I don't get it. Well, you can come challenge me again anytime. We'll ride the wind, babe. So I guess you can race them between to and from to uh I guess I'll speed you up. I just wanted to look around here for a second. That's all I wanted to do.
All right, let's do, let's take one of them. I'm kind of hoping maybe I could like, okay, now, <laughs> I can line it up a little bit. There we go. Like just a little bit. Because my thought is, if I just walk through here, I can use like so much experience and gold. Like maybe I can find like an item along the way. Like what's down there? There's actually a chest down there. It was this. Like there's a lot to fight, but the things you can find. Are very good. <laughs> I think I missed one there. I don't think I can do an attack. She relied on the good. <laughs> Tamed race recorder? Is that like a key item? Remembers bike race scores. Ah, oh, right. just so curious. <laughs> it's like I won the race, yeah, but I'm like I could explore. <laughs> I probably should just go back for now. I don't know. Maybe I'll check like what's in the next area, and then I'll just go back. Just thinking about like how far did we just ride? <laughs> so how long would this bike path actually be? <laughs> So curious. Also, oh, these monsters, what do they call mutants? Actually, that's where I came from, I think. So maybe this is the end of it. Yeah, okay. Well, let's fight them either way. Nice. Alright, let's see. Let's get Yaluka. Chrono's a little beat up too, but Yaluka first. Use a regular? I'm gonna wait for a whirl attack again. Just gonna attack everyone then. <laughs> Why not? At that, this might be a waste. Now, that's okay. I'm just kind of curious if this brings me back to the beginning. It does. All right. All right. Let's, uh, am I racing again? Okay. <laughs> cool. Well, at least I know now. I was curious. I'm like, how far is this area? Uh, so you get more points when you're ahead and then you lose points when you're behind. Makes sense. Okay. 
Oh. Nope. That didn't work. Is this the new F-Zero game? It is. How'd you know? How you doing? How you doing, Safe? Yeah, so I actually won the race already. Uh, then they decided to backtrack into an area because it looks like I could technically skip the racing, but I wasn't sure how long the area was going to be, and then it brought me back here. So I was actually about to go back, and then I realized uh, going back would actually be a bit more troublesome, I guess, because I'd be fighting the enemies again. <laughs> so I might as well just, just might as well just do this again. Just get it all the way. Come on. There we go. Am I doing alright? How about you? I'm good. A little tired. I'm not doing too bad. Really enjoying this game. <laughs> uh, love the humor. It's very, I feel like, aware? I don't, I don't know the right word to say. It's got great humor, first off. But overall, I'm enjoying the story so far. It's got a lot of mystery to it. Overall, I'm good. Very, I'm very, very, very good. Very excited for a lot of those Nintendo Directs. Games that are coming out soon. A lot of happy stuff. And what the heck is this? There's a monster. It's the monster I can actually fight. Let's just explore. Why not? <laughs> There's like a monster I can fight, but I need to see what slash. I don't think flamethrower is going to be very good. Oh, it's dead. <clears throat> I have like no food in my house. I want my freezer things back. <laughs> I'm so sorry. So the entire... Alright, it's probably a problem if I go that way. Is there anything bombs? No? Whatever. Alright. Can I cross this? No? Alright. Does this work now? Nope. I can't be here. I know where I have to go. I have to go here. I just like, I just want to explore. <laughs> so your, uh, <clears throat> your fridge is completely dead too, right? You weren't able to fix it. Actually, this could be a little troublesome. I spent like an hour or so after we talked to sh shoveling my stuff over to my pants. Oh no. It's dead. Alright. I've been... Uh, I've actually been debating on getting... Uh, ordered a new one today, so it's gonna take a few days. Okay. I was gonna say, I'm like, did you actually get one? <laughs> That's good. I've been actually debating on getting a new bed. I, I My current bed I've had for a very long time. Let's just say that. And I feel like I'm due for an upgrade. <laughs> so I've been thinking about like, getting new pillows, mattresses, like the whole shebang. But I'm just, I haven't decided on what type of mattress I want to go for yet. So that's where my current mindset is. Should then? Yeah. Like my older brother uh, got one last year. He loves his bed. I'm sure he does. <laughs> Well, it's like a very comfy bed. I'll just say that. Treat yourself? <laughs> yeah. If I'm going to treat myself to anything, that would be one thing I mandatorily need to treat myself to. <laughs> like, that's a thing you, like, you have to use every day, so... That, that's something I'd be like, yeah. I, I think my only fear is actually having to carry it up three floors. Resting the Endertron, yes! HP and MP restored, but you're still, but you're still as hungry as before. <laughs> poor, poor Corona. Have you played this actually before, Kevin? Corona Trigger. This is this is a hundred percent a game that would be up your alley. 
Uh, my, my mattress is like 12 years old, but a few years ago I bought a three inch memory foam pad that goes on top of it and it's night and day better. Yeah, mine I would say is probably like, probably around the same age, like 12 years, maybe older. I've had it for a very, very long time. So I'm thinking, I'm like, oh, honestly, I was probably still in middle school at the time. <laughs> I'd be like 15, 16 years, but like it still works. My mattress is fine. It's just, it's just old. <laughs> I love my memory foam. I think I'm thinking about some type of memory foam one. I just don't know what one yet. I have to do more research. You haven't? Okay. My pillows are memory foam as well. I want like literally everything memory foam, I think. Some type of memory foam. I just don't know what type of bed yet. I'm still debating. I have to do more research. Hmm. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, my current one, I, I love it. Like, it's behind me. <laughs> yeah, I love it. It's just, it's getting old. I, I do kind of need something new. I think my only fear is just bringing down my old mattress three flights of steps. And then when we get the new one, trying to figure out how we can get up three flights of steps to, a, like, the third floor. So that's that's where I'm currently debating on how, how to proceed with that. I sleep so much better since getting all the foam than I did before. I don't know if it would change anything for me, but I'm very curious. It doesn't sound great one way yet. I want to move out so bad. <laughs> That's one reason why I'm like, I don't really don't want to get one yet because I would rather move out first before I get one. But also I would really like one. <laughs> Kevin, Mario, Effin, Strikers. <laughs> That is a game involving Mario. It's quite striking, some might say. Uh, Kevin, Chrono Trigger, play this game <laughs> if you can. Actually, you can play this game. Sorry for my language. How fucking dare you? Fuck off. But no. Um, it was the only way to adequately convey my excitement. I'm actually kind of curious what this is. What's this? That's why I just asked Marley. Thank you for uh, being the voice of reason. It's in bad shape, but it looks like a humanoid robot. Incredible. Oh. I think I do know what this is. I think I can fix it. What? Fix it. What if it attacks us like the other ones? I'll make sure it won't. Robots don't attack on their own free will. No. They only do it because humans make them that way. Luca, you really feel for them, don't you? I better get to work. Aw. Oh. She's fixing a robot. I had all but given up on New Strikers game, and it's actually so soon. It looks amazing, honestly. I'm, very, I'm really excited for it. I'm kind of curious how it's going to go. I am a little upset that uh, Nintendo's like, hey, Camelot, just make Mario sport games. Don't worry about the Golden Suns. <laughs> but I digress. I digress. Sort of. It's just not make a sport game, it's just make Golden Sun. <laughs> That's how I feel. Remake the first one. I don't care. Reboot the whole thing. <laughs> Think I'm actually going to get the Switch OLED after all? I thought you already got it. Or did you return it? All right, that should do it. I'm going to give it some juice. What the fuck? <laughs> Robot? Good morning. Good. Good morning, mistress. What is your command? Am I your mistress? I'm Marley. This is Chrono, and that's Luca, the one who fixed you. I just did. Madam Luca restored my circuits. I hope you get Golden Sun, man. I, I, someday. Maybe we'll bring it back someday. As soon as I see Isaac and Smash Brothers, that'll give me hope. Until then, I have no hope. Uh, Madam Luca restored my circuits. Just Luca will do. 
and a manner of, of address could potentially cause offense. I am capable of offensive speech. Wait, what? Well, some of us don't like it when people are so formal all the time, isn't that right, Marley? <laughs> Understood, Luca. Alright, so what's your name? Rain? Perhaps you're referring to my serial number. My serial number is R66Y. <laughs> cool. Cool, what are you talking about? That won't do at all. Come on, Colonel, let's give him a better name. Because his name is Robo. It's default. I'm keeping all the default themes, by the way. Just for the record. Uh, I did, but it was from Walmart. Oh, that's right. Which was a bad choice. I need to wait for GameStop stock so I can trade my current Switch in for it. 250 trade in is basically half price. It seems like Nintendo is planning on dominate my gaming this year. <laughs> planning to dominate my gaming this year. Yeah. No, I completely understand that. One Direct, they did a lot. They have a lot coming out this year, so I'm excited. Robo. Yes, Robo, that's perfect. Your new name is Robo, okay. My name is Robo. <laughs> Data storage complete. Hey Robo, there's something I was hoping you could... What happened here? This dome contained many humans and others like me. Oh dear, this is kind of hard to say, but I think something awful happened while you were out. I don't think anyone else... Anyone else is left. I see. What about yourselves? We came through a g time warp from th from the year 1000. <laughs> True. We learned there was a gate here when we went to Aristotle. And then we found you and we came looking for the gate. But the door to the inner chamber is sealed shut, so it looks like we're out of luck. It's got busted open. Dome's power has been shut off completely. Oh, okay. And I still have several Switch games I haven't been able to get into yet. Like, that I've already purchased. I'm the same. I still have Switch games were probably like two years ago that I was gifted that I haven't even started. Like Astral Chain, I got that like two years ago. I haven't played it. Like Octopath Traveler is another one I want to get to at some point, just haven't gotten to. Uh, someone told me to buy uh, Darksiders Genesis and I never got to play that. That's another one. It's a couple games. Uh, the dome's power has been shot off completely. The factory to the north contains an emergency power generator for this dome. I can bypass security to activate it. Shall we go there? Yeah. You do that for us? You repaired me. Now it's my turn to be of assistance. I like this robot. However, the generator will produce power for only a short time. Someone must remain here to open the door as soon as power is restored to the dome. Harley or I can stay. Who will stay behind? Um, crap. I think I want to leave Luca behind because Marley can at least heal. I do have a lot of potions. But can Robo heal? I like... I think... Okay, I do have a lot of potions. I'll leave Marley behind. Yeah. Leave Marley. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. I like it. Okay. Uh, Marley. Okay, be careful, Corona. Maybe I can come back and change my mind. I don't know. <laughs> I seems to continue to play another. So I was thinking of playing Octopath on Game Pass. That's not a bad idea. I want to play. Like, I had got it on Switch. And then it came out on Game Pass, I think, last year. After I already got it on Switch, and I already started it on Switch. But I need to get back into it. So where am I supposed to go? I can't imagine how boring it's been here. Can I take Lucas? No. Okay, I'll just wait here. <laughs> wait, so where exactly? I should have read that better. Oh, I think I'm going up here. 
because I had to take uh, Robo with me. I think. I could be wrong. No, I was right. Cool. Override security system zero zero. Then we get the fight. All right, cool. Uh, let's do cyclo. What can you do? Rocket punch and cure beam. Perfect. Okay, we're fine. Robo can kill. <laughs> That's all I need. I still kind of want Mario Golf, like a little. Now here's my problem with Mario Golf, and I feel like I'm gonna have the same problem with Strikers. I feel like it's gonna be the first month I'm gonna play it. Everyone's gonna play it and it's gonna be great and then no one's gonna touch it again. <laughs> that's how I sort of feel with Mario Golf, or Strikers at the moment. So I'm pretty sure that's what happened with tennis and that's what happened with golf with me. <laughs> yeah, I played it when it came out, had a lot of fun. Played it with friends for like the first month and then it was never touched again. <laughs> It is a fun game, though. Like, I will truly say that it's fun. I enjoyed it a lot. The multiplayer is also very fun. Very fun, very good. Words. I would recommend. I think I enjoyed golf more than I did tennis, if I'm being honest. Uh, are they on my level here? Wait, shelter. Cool. All right, they are here. Am I doing health wise? We're good. That was horrible. Oh, because I used fire. All right, going forward, not going to do that. Should I probably not really? Didn't know. Alright, wind slash all the way. Do cure. Not bad. Excuse me. Robo learn laser spin. Learn supersonic spin dull attack. Nice. Cure beam actually heals a bit. Quite a bit. <laughs> I don't know, I think Striker should have more longevity, but many games but so many games come out so I can totally see that people just move just more on quick move on quickly to the next thing. I need to make a list of all the Switch games I still want to get so I can watch the sales, hopefully. I can get that. Like, to me, I look at the games, I'm like, I want them, but what time am I going to have to play them? So I feel like I want to limit myself to the ones that I actually really want to get, and then go from there. Hatch opened. Okay. Oh, hey. Let's see that. Definitely a one slash enemy. Or regular attack? Oh, that works. Alright. What's this? Robot? Domo? It's gonna counterattack everything. Yeah, there's. I don't know. Like, a game I'm kind of curious about is that one game, Live and Live. After I read up about it, I was like, this game I'm very curious in. Like, it could be like sneak, sneaky good. Like, it's a remake of a game that was only Japan only and it's coming to the US or North America. It's going out of, you know what I mean? It's getting localized. So, I don't know. I looked at it and I'm like, this actually looks kind of good. <laughs> but I also feel like since it's from the looks of it, the same people that made, uh, Octopath Traveler and Triangle Strategy, all that jazz, I'm assuming, like same studios. That they could potentially also go to other consoles. Yeah, 
but it, I mean, it looks good. <laughs> like, it looks really good. Also, I think I'm falling in love with Robo. There we go. Get it, Robo. All systems down, defense lasers deactivated. Spin? Let's do that. So no fire. But yeah, seriously. It live and live looks great. Uh, Splatoon. I feel like I like I want to get. <laughs> I just don't know how I feel about it. <laughs> like it's just more Splatoon to me. <laughs> I guess it doesn't look like it's a whole lot different. It does look interesting. Like I wanna like, I want to like, oh, uh, that's really good armor. Uh, Splatoon, I just, I don't know how much time I'm gonna have with it. <laughs> it's kind of where you're at too. Like, I don't know. They're, they're releasing so many multiplayer games within that time frame. I'm like, I don't know how I feel about this. Is this a ladder too? What ladders do we have? All right, let's go down this one first. Actually, on second thought, let's check what the one up here was. Teleporter. Uh, all right, I'm going down first. Like, I, I do, like, don't get me wrong. I do enjoy it. Platoon's great. I just, I don't know. <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay. So you can take me back all the way to the top floor. Cool. Seems like a trap. Plasma gun. Hey. The voice. Because I feel like uh, Splatoon, I don't know how I feel about. Zabby door lock system operational, please enter passcode. Oh my god, I don't know the passcode. I guess. Oh, that was wrong. Try again. I think you can guess this right. That yeah, worked. All right. I didn't know what the passcode was. Just random buttons. Why is there so many? I don't think I should have done that. Just trying to interact with things. Is there a reactor? Emergency the system security system has been go has gone haywire. We must escape immediately. I'm gonna go up here though. I guess we're escaping. Oh, that's not good. Robo! Hurry before it's too late. Elevators to save. Great. Uh, Xenoblade 2 physical switch copies are kind of expensive. Were you looking to buy it? Also, I do agree the game is actually expensive now. Like physically. I ended up giving my brother mine. He told me he was going to start playing it uh, a couple months back and he hasn't yet. At some point, maybe. I will say, it is definitely a game that takes a while to get used to. But it does get good. Wait, these are my friends. R64Y, R67Y, R69Y, nice. 
Uh, it's good to see you again. Oh, that's not good. What are you doing? You are defective. You are now one of us. Pardon. I'm a malfunction. Affirmative. Defect. I am the defect. We've forgotten our assigned the task. All intruders must be eliminated. That was the reason for my creation. You disgrace our series. You must be destroyed. Oh no. Wait, can I not? I actually cannot help. Please stop, please. Do not harm them, please. These robots are my brothers. So say it. <laughs> now we should eliminate the intruders. What the fuck? Less than a month until the Matrix Resurrection 4K comes out. Kind of hard to believe that's already been out for so long. Like a month or two now? Trails next week. Nice. Both bell. No. I think the intruders will eliminate you. Oh, it's pissed. Okay. Um. My head in the way. My head's kind of in the way. Let's do this. Actually, I didn't even think about it. This battle's gonna be kind of tough if you don't have a healer. I wanna pick uh, both of those in Ghostbusters Afterlife. Good choices. <laughs> Get a heal in. There you go. I should have used a better potion. It's fine. Do I have to use this? So my character has like a counter ring right now, so every time he gets attacked, there's like a 50% chance he can counter. Which seems to be paying off. I just have to keep my health up. <laughs> hey, we're good. I think the battle wasn't so much tough in that there were tough. It's more like there's just so many of them. <laughs> Robo. I see him, he got stuck. They really thrashed him, I'm not sure I can fix this. Let's get him back to Proto Dome for now. I actually got a happy about Luca. Can you fix me? <laughs> Marley fell asleep. Don't try to talk. 
for trying to change the world. I don't know how far we'll get, but that's the plan. Anyway, Robo, what do you want to do after I finish repairing you? What do I want to do? Yeah, I mean, you were stuck here all this time. There must be a lot of things you want to do, right? No one's ever asked me that before, Luca. I love Robo. Get bored. Robo, thank goodness you're all right. Luca, you're incredible. Well, let's hope I never have to do that again. Luca, I have arrived at an answer to your question. I want to go with you. Really? You mean it? Is this a good thing to do, though? There's nothing left for me here. I want to help you. Together, we might be able to give the life on this planet a chance. Now let's go. The gate's right through there. I think it's a bad idea. We're bringing something from the future to the present. <laughs> well, maybe this is a little bit better than passive. Right I know where am I? That's why I just asked. Yeah, I think Matrix Resurrection, Eternals, Ghostbusters. I feel like there's another one. Either way, <laughs> you've seen the new Ghostbusters, I think, too, right? After all, I think we've all seen it. Like, me, you, Kyle. Very good movie. Uh, where are we? You did. Okay. I feel like I'm between, like, three dimensions? Wait, change my team. <laughs> Can I bring Robo with me? I want to use Robo. I don't want to use Marley. <laughs> All right, guy. What's up, man? Ah, uh, more drifters. Maybe use Mark. Ah, drifters. Where are we? It's not a question of where, my friends, as so much as when. This is the end of time. Travelers lost in time's flow turn up here, much like driftwood on a beach. My ex, where you are from. We're from 1000 AD. I come from the year 2300 AD. When four or more entities of varying origins enter a temporal rift together, the torsion exerted on time's flow pushes them to the point of at least resistance here. There have been a number of folks turning up here unattended. Recently, like yourselves, I fear something is having a powerful effect on the very fabric of time. There's more people doing this. Which means it would be safest if one of us stayed here. Oh. Uh, it is a black, it is a bleak place, isn't it? Not to worry for all its dissolution. Desolation it is well connected. There are roads here to any time you could ever wish to visit. Should you so desire, you can call upon your friends at any time. But you can never travel in groups of more than three. Okay. One of us must remain. Oh, B Chrono. I feel like from a story perspective, I should keep it like Marley with my team. I really like Robo. <laughs> Let's do that. Don't leave me here for long, Chrono. I will forever. Uh, I did yes, all in theaters. I'm planning to see Uncharted and Batman in the next few weeks. Oh, that's nice. Oh, did they reopen your theaters? I thought last we talked about they were still closed, I think. Uh, should you use Desire to switch party members, you can do so via the main, the main menu whenever you wish. How do we get back to our own time? You saw the pillars of light when you arrived, yes? Each connects this place to a different era. Once you've been through a gate, you can use it to return here whenever you wish. Step back into the light and press A once more to return the gate. 
Oh, yeah, so sorry, excuse me. But beware the gate connected to that bucket. This bucket? Hey! <laughs> Oi! What? Hey! 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 Just curious. Whack! Hey, Trap. How are you doing? Just curious. It's down here. Huh? Alright. Cool. Before you go, have a look past the door behind me. Okay. What are you? <laughs> That's what I asked. How are you doing, Drev? Snack bars reopened too. When I saw Matrix and Spider-Man in December, emissions were open then, but no snack bar, then closed. Okay. Yeah, for me, they're starting to reopen stuff where I'm at. At least work-wise, they reopen stuff. Um, by reopen, I mean uh, they got rid of our mask mandate at work, which I feel like we, we should definitely still have our mask on. <laughs> at least at work, but uh, that's where I'm kind of at. Like, the state still mandates it. Like, at certain areas. Not the state, but like cities. Still mandate like certain like areas, like restaurants and stuff. But my work just opened it up completely. So I'm, I'm, a, little, I'm, a, little, I'm a little on edge. Doing alright, just got home from work. Feeling pretty wiped out and really chill. I feel that. <laughs> I'm glad work Well, I suppose you can always choose to keep wearing one. I know if our mask mandates go away, I'll keep mine on for a while. Yeah, that's where I'm at. It's voluntary. And I feel like I'm the only one in the building. That's wearing my mask right now. But I'm, uh, I'm not really being questioned about it. Like, I was axed originally, and then it was kind of like, whatever. But I still wear mine. Uh, I'm Speckio, the master of war. I watch all kinds of battles from here. How do I look to you? Say straw. Well, now you know, actually, no, I'm being honest. You don't think. I see. How I look depends on how strong you are. If you're strong, I look strong. If you're weak, I look weak. Oh, well, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you've got it in you, don't you? That must be why the old guy let you through. See, a long, long time ago, before you were born, there was a kingdom where magic flourished. Everyone there could use it. But the people abused their powers and ended up destroying the, pal uh, the place. <sighs> Sorry about that. Uh, after that, there wasn't anyone left who could use magic well, except fiends, of course. But you have it. Inner strength, I mean. Magic needs power of the heart. That's where it flows from. I got run to the corner of the store. I'm back shortly. All good. <laughs> have a good break. Uh, there's four types of magic, fire, water, light, and shadow. Not everyone's got the same type. So Chrono's got light. You with the punk hair, dude, you've got light, yeah. <laughs> that girl with the goofy glasses, her power is fire. What's with this big clunky thing? Sorry, bud, well, you aren't alive. <laughs> you've got great inner strength for what it's worth, it's just... You aren't descended from the ancient magic user, so you're never going to be able to cast spells. Your laser weapons are what should suffice, though. They can inflict shadow damage. Kind of like shadow magic. By the way, it's not just magic. Everything is made up of those four elements. Uh, Alright, starting from the door, circle clockwise along the walls of my room three times and say, I want to use magic over and over in your head. Don't lose track now three times. Don't want you turning yourselves into butter. I'm saying it in my head. Like, oh wait, clockwise. Wait, yeah. <laughs> I'm going counterclockwise. All right, clockwise, got it. <laughs> How many times can I do this? I think it's at three. Crazy, stop me. 
Alright. No cheating, I've got my eye on you. Do it over from the door, clockwise along the wall, three times. Okay. That's three. I definitely went clockwise, I'm saying that much. Or maybe we have to do it from here. I think I'm going clockwise. I am going clockwise, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I did it like 15 times. <laughs> Ipso facto minimo magico. Chrono learned to use magic? Luca learned to use magic. <laughs> Robo can now learn magic. <laughs> you were indeed going clockwise. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. So, all for two uh, magic one try. Yes. All right. White. All right, let's see. All right, relax. I can use lightning. What can you do? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. It's fire. Can I combine? I'm so curious with these attacks. Like, how long is this battle going for? Oh, so this guy's actually kind of tough. Dead. <laughs> Luca's dead, at least. Let's get her back up. She only may live for my one attack. Oh, we won. Okay, cool. Oh, me, oh my. That was embarrassing. <laughs> Guess you uh, ain't so bad after all. Here, this is for you. Specchio's special refresher set? Obtained one magic capsule and five ethers. Huh. What can I say? I'm the master of war. Really? You make any new friends? You bring them to see me. You hear? I like you guys. Okay, so I could technically bring Marley in here. Hey. Hey. Well, well, it seems I was right. People who lived long ago all enjoyed such powers, you know? Yes, long, long ago. Well, I know you must be here to finish this thing you seem so intent on doing, but why not first pay a visit back to your own era? Haste makes waste, as they say. You'll find that even truer here. Come and see me whenever you have the need. Think of me as your guide on time for it. Okay. So, I kind of, I should have brought... Oh, yes. We'll bring back Robo, but I feel like I need to bring Marley in. The guy with the ponytail has the power of water. Ipso facto minimo magico. <laughs> Marley learned to use magic. Cool. Yeah, let's try it out again. Oi! <laughs> Alright, she uses ice. Oh, damn. 
Like looking at my attacks, I'm like, I need to heal badly. <laughs> Or else I might be dead here. So I just want to give Marley her uh, thing and then move on. Luca's dead. <laughs> Maybe you can just keep attacking the all way. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Just give us some stuff. That's why I'm like, uh Good Tessa. Alright, I wanna bring Robo with me. Like, I appreciate you, Marley, but uh I'll use Robo. <laughs> My thing is like I'm thinking of like story purposes. I feel like I'm gonna go back and like where's Marley? <laughs> like, oh I should probably should bring her back. Um Okay. No. no. Guess we're going back to our time. Yeah. Like a little weird. <laughs> so how did I disappear? Folks came out of my wardrobe, didn't you? What are you doing in here? Where am I? Who do you think you are coming and going from someone else's wardrobe by hour at all hours of night and day? Humans, I tell you. But why are monsters in homes? Wait a minute. Medina is a village of fiends, founded by ancestors when they lost their war against humankind 400 years ago. Most of the townsfolk still have a grudge against humans, so be careful. There is an odd old human who lives near a cave in the mountains to the west. He may be able to help you out. Thank you for your advice. But why are you being so kind? Do you people not despise humans? It's been 400 years since man warred against fiend. There's no use living in the past, of course. Not many other fiends seem to agree with that. Okay. Where am I? What is the meaning of this eerie chanting? I don't think I was supposed to be here. Sleep? Humans think they've got the right to everything. Teach them a lesson, boss. Oh, I'm, I'm leaving. <laughs> Okay, so he's like up to the west. Am I still back in the old area I was just in? Where am I? This is somewhere else. That's the freaking music. <laughs> Alright, let's go west. He's like a west. I'm listening to him. El Chor's cabin. I think I'm just on a different continent. Hello. Oh, I've come to see me. Well, by all means, have a look at my collection. Can I interest you in a weapon? Give you a special. Yes. What are you selling? <laughs> Alright, let's at least sell some stuff I already have that I know I'm never going to use again. Cool. What's magic capsules? <clears throat> From the raise. Oh, magic by one. Damn. Okay, let's see. Uh, Crimson Blade, yes. Okay, I guess Bandit's Bow, yes. I right, two of those. I do appreciate I can still equip stuff here. Like, even if they're not in my party anymore, I can still give them, like, some equipment. It's kind of nice. Love her going straight from iron to titanium. <laughs> I 
Weapons are not meant for the taking of lives, they're meant for saving them. Okay. Thank you, so. Just kind of curious, like looking around me, like, there's gotta be something here. Hecran Keith. It's back. Oh, Hecran. Death to the enemies of the fiend kind. Or just fiend kind. Whatever. I mean, I'm very curious what the ruins were. <laughs> like the forest ruins? I kind of want to go back to that. Big crystal in the middle. Right, I'm not going to lie. That actually, the sword looks kind of cool. I didn't realize that I was going to change a little bit. Learned Fire Punch Dull Tech. Can I go down? <laughs> Ether? I was say, what is that? Definitely not a pot. <laughs> yeah, I need to take. Oh, the gin bottle. Definitely gotta take it out. I didn't work on it, maybe? I'll definitely do. Uh, let's see, fire roll or fire punch? It's fire punch. Oh, I did fire roll. All Anything I really want to Can I still do some type of like healing world like a heal everyone? I think that's the only thing I really like with Marley. Compared to Robo. Luga kinda just feels like the magic user, I suppose. Like strong elemental attacks. Not so much physical. Marley's kinda more like a healer, but it's not exactly like a healer. Robo could be like an in-between. That does like a little bit of attack, but also a little bit of other stuff. I do kind of wonder if Marley levels up on her own. That was another thing I was trying to think. I'm starting to think not, but. I'm like staring at that. I'm like, I should probably attack. <laughs> Alright, so they got very strong armor, so. 100% have to use magic. If I want to do like any type of damage, it's like magic only. <laughs> Physical attacks will not work.
Not bad. There. It's a safe station up there. Kind of wondering where that would take me. <laughs> what the hell is this? <laughs> Let's try Cyclone, maybe? Just regular old Cyclone. <laughs> it's like, get them all? <laughs> Very nice. very defensive. Like, even enemies that we've already fought in the past. Like, we've 100% fought these bats before. I don't remember them taking, like, three damage from a physical attack. I'm just trying to watch my MP. It's getting a little low. Okay. Overall, not doing too bad. All right, so we got another one of these. I think I'm just gonna use uh, lightning on the, the little bottle, little bottle friendly. this thing. I really want to know. Oh, I can go toward the uh... yeah, the staircase from before. Perfect. How am I health-wise? I'm pretty good. A little low on MP though, actually. So let me fix that real quick. Alright, that's better. Maybe I wish I bought more MP. Like I'm buying weapons, that's great. I haven't bought many items. That doesn't sound good. Death to the enemies of fiend kind. Crap. Hello. I was trying to get ready to attack. <laughs> Can I use Hypno Wave? Very curious. Don't think this will work. Yeah, didn't think so. Usually doesn't work against bosses, but I was just curious. Uh, definitely need to heal Luka. Hundred percent heal. <laughs> Even Corona needs some healing. Uh, I have a med potion. All right, let's get done. Okay. I've always hoarded items and RPGs like this. I always feel like I'll, I'll need them later and then just never use them. Like, I feel like, to me, I feel like I want to buy items. 
but I'm also a little hesitant. Because I'm like, I might need to use it for equipment later. <laughs> so like, I debate with myself, I'm like, do I need the... the uh... Ah, you saw the wrong person. Kill yourself. <laughs> Am I trying to rush the heal? And I'm like, <laughs> messing myself up here. Yeah, I just feel like I'm like, I could use this for like items layer, or weapons, or equipment. And I hope I can just grind in areas and then eventually get something. <laughs> this guy doesn't seem too bad, though. Alright, this counter ring's amazing. I love it. That's a lot of HP, I'll say that. Come here, man. Do I want to try and attack you? We get that, you know what? Who am I going to? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the thing is just like, oh, it's disappointing. All right, Luke got a little bit up there, but also a Robo's got a little bit up there. But I totally get the idea of just like hoarding items and then just never using them. I get that entirely. I feel like there's no in between. There's either like you're gonna hoard items, just have a lot, or what uh, the heck, or uh, <laughs> you're not gonna have enough items. So like there's no in between. I'm almost out of MP. Oh, we won. Okay, cool. As long as I'm Bob. The only Lord Magus had destroyed the human race 400 years ago when he first brought forth Lavos. The world would belong to us fiends now. Wait. Had destroyed the human race 400 years ago when he first brought forth Lavos. Is Magus? Maybe the guy we saw in the statue? Like in the intro? Rawr. <laughs> I think he's dead. <laughs> so Magus created Lavos in the Middle Ages, and in the future, Lavos destroys the planet. We used the gate at the fairgrounds. Okay. That is a question. Jump in. It's like, eh, why not? <laughs> oh. Cool. I do like how everything's kind of like linking up. You go to the end. <laughs> yeah, please. Fill me up. I think they'd just be like, why do you have a giant robot with you? Um, okay. Well, let's go to the market. See if there's anything to buy. I mean, we have a uh, Chrono. Oh, you really saved my neck. Going to be, oh, Fritz. Yeah. For one for you. Phew, was I ever in a tight spot? I've gone off on a buying trip. I think I showed my dad I didn't need him anymore. That was all well and good, but then some soldiers showed up at the inn where I was staying to arrest a gang of thieves and mistook me for one of the criminals. They wouldn't listen to a word I said. They were going to execute me, just like that. So, phew, I owe you one. We're in your debt. Thank you ever so much. Don't tell my dad I gave you these. Can't tell him. Hey, D -d Dad. <laughs> You're not shirking off, are you? I am. I mean, of course not. No, of course not. Well, all right then. 
Corona, I appreciate what you did. Oh, okay. Good talk. Oh, Chrono, down to business. Please, won't you buy something? Silly. Without buying anything, just take the free item and walk away. <laughs> oh, I never equipped her the, uh... Oh, I sold it. I'm smart. <laughs> I bought it and then immediately sold it. I think that's what I did. <laughs> oh, she is leveling up. Cool. I was actually curious if she would. Um... Alright, we'll buy like 20. <laughs> Alright, I'll hold off on the sh definitely the shelters. Thanks! Alright, bye. Um... Uh... So at least I go to the fairground. So maybe I want to go back. There's really nothing else over here because there was like the vampires, the castle, Lucas House. Oh, I can go across the bridge. I was say, what's going on here now? I'm opening a stall at the fairgrounds. Drop by if you get the chance. Huh. I guess I should go back to the fairgrounds. Where does this take me to? This feels more like a desert. Is there like no one living on this continent down here? Okay, there's there are people here. There's a civilization. What do we got? Bears Manor? Let's check it out. Children are slipping away from us. It's so painful to see. Okay. I run this town, so I'm I'm so rich I don't know what to do with it all. Give you 10G if you spin around three times and cluck like a chicken. No, oh, thank you. What a dick. What you got? Everybody says daddy's greedy. That's not true, is it? Bye, kid. <laughs> I want to go to the fair, too. Granny and Grams went to the Millennial Fair and Truce. We're keeping an eye on the house. Snail stop? Let's take a... Some monsters can coexist with humans. Take that piano player, for instance. Four centuries ago, a woman named Fiona died trying to revive the great forest that once flourished to the north. It's a sad tale. Four centuries ago. Alright, so in the past. Everyone's off to that festival. Bunch of lazy souts. <laughs> I'm the piano man. What do you want me to play? Play, play me something upbeat. That work. <laughs> Got some spice to jerky. I've been saving it for a special occasion. I might let's, uh, let's go for nine thousand. So I don't have that money anymore. You know what I mean? I save my money and I'm good. <laughs> Why would I spend it? Oh yeah, you got $9,000. <laughs> yeah, these are actually some very, very weak items. I kinda wonder if, uh... <laughs> I kinda wonder if the item is actually really good or if he's just trying to rip you off. Very much be a rip off. I'm so sorry. I feel very tired today. <laughs> Alright, let's go south. I guess we'll let's go to the fairgrounds. 
fairgrounds at the fair ground um uh, yeah okay i got you mean <laughs> the fairgrounds at the fair <laughs> She said use the gate here. Gasp indeed. Something just happened. Cause that's new. Hey you drifter. Come and see me whenever you have the need. Think of me as your guide on time time dread. Oh, yeah, I need you. Okay, so we just came from the square. Do I want to go back in time? Prado don't. What's this one? Truce Cannon. Yeah, they mentioned this. Let's go here. Canyon? I feel like maybe I should talk to people actually. <laughs> Wait, so they mentioned... Okay. I mentioned something about four centuries ago. She died, Fiona died on some forest. I think I'm getting to a point where things are getting a little bit more open world. <laughs> you kind of have to start figuring out yourself, like talk to everyone, figure out what you need to do. Luca leveled up, cool. And I'm not sure if I have the entire mindset at the moment to actually remember things. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Oh, So they said, if only if Magus, Lord Magus summoned. Lavos. Runners say the Fiend Lord's army has reached the Zenon Bridge. What will happen now, I wonder? Wait. Okay, I might have to go there. Maybe I should do that next. There's nothing to worry about now. The heroes come to save us. There's no. Oh, the frog, toad friend. Can he save us? Yeah, let's go find him. Love this world map music. Can actually say him. I think I need to go to the bridge. Yeah, there's something going on here. Our provisions are depleted. Have the supplies still not arrived from the castle? We'll starve at this rate. With that, our strength were enough to best the Fiend Lord's army, but alas, our only hope lies with the hero. We have no more foodstuffs. <laughs> no more foodstuffs. Oh no. Uh, we sent our orders, finest knights, to march on the enemy in order to ensure the hero is safe passage. I have thought those stories of the hero would come bearing the badge no more than bedtime tales. That's a mouthful. But now he's come, and there's little to do but trust in him. It appears our men and the Fiend Lords are locked in battle upon the bridge. May we emerge victorious. Could the hero alone truly have the power to defeat army? No, probably not. Okay, has gotta move. <laughs> Y'all let me. I feel like your toad friend's gonna need help. <laughs> Will you let me go? Guess I have to get to the castle? Let's 
check the castle here. I'll get attacked, right? Oh. It's a shelter. Thank you. Bolt, who goes there? Oh, it's you again. <laughs> Fiendlord's troops threatened to break us, but now the hero has appeared, we are saved. Uh, Lord Krenna, the Greek hero, has appeared from the very pages of legend. He arrived not long ago and left to meet the king. His majesty is recuperating in bed. Recuperating? What happened to the king? Queen Lean has been at his majesty's bedside all day. Need night and day. <laughs> what happened to the king? Wait, let's go up. Our king fought bravely against the fiend lord's troops, leading charge with that after charge. Had he not received word of the hero's arrival, he may well have fought his, to his death. Queen Lee will collapse if she does not get some rest. Sir Cyrus must have sent that boy to us. Uh, okay. Oh, Chrono, have I grown too old for all this? With Sir Cyrus nowhere to be found, all of our hope rests on the soldier of that boy who bears the hero's badge. He has gone to the southern continent now to search for the sword that can slay Magus. Okay. So the answer is no, I should not be here. <laughs> Okay, so the hero went to the south. I just gotta go through the forest again. <laughs> so hero went south to get the sword to defeat Magus, but I can't cross the bridge. So it won't let me. So I can't get to the continent down south unless I take a different portal. They refuse to let me go. <laughs> All right, so maybe I should not be here right now. So maybe I have to go to a different time period. I feel like I need like a notepad to actually start writing stuff down. <laughs> so I can start taking notes. Okay, so. All right, so everyone's pretty much saying. Where are you going? Just as I was preparing to finish the touchings on Lincoln's bell, our king was wounded by Magus' fiends in battle. It's enough to make a man lose his will to work. I hope the bell will ring in the age of peace. It, yeah, well. <laughs> it's not to everyone. They say even the king himself was wounded. Not the end. The hero has come. So it's talk to you. I heard the fiend lord's army has broken our line to get Bridge. Have you heard? He's come at last. The hero, the legendary hero. <laughs> He's gotten to see the king already. Now the fiend lord hasn't ch has a chance. I hope you find out like I'm actually the hero. <laughs> but no, you actually know he met the hero, so it's not me. Um. Yeah, I can't do anything here, so, yeah. <laughs> can't cross the bridge. I think I gotta get to a different time period that will let me get there, maybe. Like, I have to find, like, another gate somewhere. I mean, we used the fairground. wonder if they're talking about a different gate. And they mentioned fairground. I wonder if she maybe she was talking about that area where uh, I was like just recently at. <laughs> maybe we should explore there more. Boo. Oh, jeez. Hey, do a llama. <laughs> oh, come on then. How dare you terrify me? How are you doing? Uh, it's fine. This fine day. 
Damn it, go back. Oh, well, this game looks just like those GBA Dragon Ball games. Yeah, right? It does remind me of it though, honestly. Like obviously those games were definitely inspired by this. But uh Yeah. But the music and everything does sound familiar to those. So, so that's why I'm like, this is like those games definitely were inspired by this. I did see the new direct. I'm very excited for a couple things. Very excited. All right, I'm gonna go back to my better. I think there was something I missed here. Can I go talk to the cat now? <laughs> Wait, can I do the whole cat thing still? I'm not gonna eat your food. Uh, I didn't realize there was gonna be one and I had to log into YouTube at 7 p.m. because I was busy the rest of the day. And I saw a bunch of Nintendo videos that they upload and I was like, oh, Nintendo's doing a lot today. And then there was a direct, I was like, oh. <laughs> You're like, oh, everything makes sense. <laughs> Glad I didn't get spoiled on anything in the actual direct. Were you able to, I was gonna say, were you able to actually watch it? Or is that sarcasm that you were spoiled? He has a, a million videos popping up on the, the channel. <laughs> Can I go back in here? Can I go back? Oh, I dropped everything I watched at the moment. Are you currently watching it or did you watch the whole thing already? Perfect timing. Another great invention just completed the ultimate in defense for my beautiful daughter. Hold on. Luca, here you go, I guess. Has fire damage. That's not bad. Alright. Alright, yeah, it's a 7 o'clock. I, I, I can comprehend things right now. My mind's definitely not fully there right now. <laughs> All over the place. That's cool. No, there's a lot that I'm actually excited about from that direct that I saw. It looks very, very good. All right, I think I need to talk to the people to get a hint. Not to you guys. In. All right, maybe I should go to the fairground by a different time period. <laughs> a little lost. <laughs> yeah, no, seriously, there are very exciting announcements. There's a lot that I'm excited for from them. You can travel time like Ocarina of Time? Yeah, pretty much. Uh, you can keep a lot more time travel and aspects to this game. But yeah, this game is very heavily influenced by time travel. Don't think there's a proto down. Adina Village? That would be my... Oh, yeah. Wait. Let's go. Hi again. Oh, is there magic in you? Magic using humans were supposed to have died a while long ago. Oh, they, no they noticed that. It's kind of cool.
Oh, great for you, Lord. Yeah, that's Magus. Five, 400 years have passed since Magus commanded the fiends and waged war against the humans. But if Lavos can be reawakened, there will be no more humans. It was the fiend lord Magus who gave life to the almighty Lavos to aid us. And once Lavos awakened from his long slumber, the human race is doomed. So maybe I should not be here though. <laughs> the tiny piccolos. Yeah, seriously. I was thinking like piccolos or uh Emperor Pilafs. <laughs> or Gohana. I heard that this game is a staple SNES game, but I've never had the chance to own or play it. I'm in, I'm loving this game. <laughs> Honestly. I think we're about how many hours? Six and a half. It's really good. <laughs> No jokes. What I'm trying to figure out is where they go. Because the character that we're with, she has pink hair of the glass. Her name is Luca. She mentioned something about going to the gate at the fairground. That's where I went. I feel like I... The forest. Oh, they talked about Fiona. Yeah, let's explore here for a second. What's this? No, seriously, I've been thoroughly enjoying this game, like, immensely. Game has a lot of great humor, and I can kind of see where a lot of games were inspired by this game. Like, gameplay-wise and everything. Can either, you can restore your PP now. Seriously, no, I actually can. Well, this game they consider it MP, but yeah. Wish this was on the Switch, would love to play a handheld, seriously. I mean, at least Earthbound's on the Switch now. Which, that was a game I've been wanting to play. I'm actually very excited to see that on the Switch. I'm a little lost here. Can I go to the Elder's house? Just don't kill me? Blast that Ozzy, wait, Ozzy the Faith, always whining, always hiding behind his ancestral fiend to boss us around. This work is brutal. <laughs> I'm Ozzy the Faith, the leader of this village, my great, 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 great grandfather. My great, 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 great grandfather fought against the humans at the side of the fiend for himself. Oh, great, great fiend lord, why didn't you exterminate the human race four centuries ago when you had the chance? Something glowing. Speed capsule. I should really use these capsules. Earthbound Switch is awesome. Definitely going to be hopping on that. Seriously. I'm actually very excited to actually jump back in. Well, at least jump into it, finally. Uh, let's do... Uh, get your speed up. Oh, well. Luca. Yeah, her magic is really good. Alright. Fearsome beast lives in the cave on the mountain to the west. Only magic can harm it. I doubt a human would be able to make it through, not being able to use magic at all. Well, I better get back to tidying up before. <laughs> Alright, well, that's a hint I probably knew from before. That's fine. Yeah, I'm excited to give Earthbound another go. I never finished it when I played it on the Wii U, but I really liked it. Yeah, that's my thing. I bought on the Wii U a, year, a couple of years ago. Four years ago, actually. Uh, I keep t kept telling myself every year, I'm like, okay, I'm going to play it, I'm going to play it, I'm going to play it. Now it's finally going to play it <laughs> this year. And then this happens, and I'm like, you know what? <laughs> I guess I can wait. <laughs> or at least, at least I don't need to play it on my Wii U. I can just play it on my Switch, which was kind of nice. I got the final boss and never actually finished it. Jeez. Hi. No stinking humans gonna talk to me? Alright, fine. Alright, so there's really nothing to do here. They kind of gave me the hints and everything, and I already... <laughs> Talked, I checked the forest, there's something there. 
went through the portal and the ligament thing. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I wonder if I need to bring Marley with me. Like through this whole area. I'm gonna head out though. Had a busy day. Want to sleep? Have fun with Dragon Ball Ocarina of Time. <laughs> Thanks. Appreciate it. Have a good one, Lama. I'm uh. In an area I did not go to. I really should just use my magic. <laughs> now I'm trying to figure out, I gotta figure out where to go. As I fall asleep. Is everyone going to put me asleep? Can Robo sleep? I feel like, is that a thing? <laughs> Do robots sleep? As soon as I did that, I was like, that was a mistake. Take your time, Chrono. <laughs> Pick up eventually. There you go. Magic scarf. It's like an accessory? Yep. Magic plus two. Uh, okay. Luca. <laughs> Definitely for you. Alright, cool. Well, actually, at least I'm a little guy I went back because I missed that entirely last time. Yeah, I need to get back over there. So that will take me to a gate I have not been to. I think the game's like, you've already finished all these enemies off. You can't really fight them again. <laughs> not right now, at least. But you're a little strong. Well, not strong, but they're just like, you already fought them. You're good. Alright, let's go ahead and save again. Yeah, so we beat the boss here. Fell through here. <clears throat> so I talked about Magus. I don't know. So only a couple more areas I could explore, because it's definitely not here. Maybe I go further in the past? If I can. Let's see where I can go. Because I figured the new portal opened up, so I figured that was the one I had to go to. Maybe it's not. So what do we have? Because that's 600 AD. This is 1000 AD. Because this is similar to... Okay, this, these two are the same time period. 65 million BC. And then that's AD. Can I go? Let's go to 65 million BC. If there's nothing here, <laughs> in 65 million BC, uh, I'm pretty sure we have to go. Probably where it was originally. Wait, have I been here?
Okay. I don't think I've, yeah, I have not been here before. Maybe I should be here. Hi, dinosaurs. Oh. <laughs> oh, hi, friends. Oh, you want to kill me? Thanks. Okay, so this is probably where I need to be. It's figured, you know, exploring a little bit <laughs> through, I guess, the area where Magus is might have been good. I guess they're just like, nah, the, the hero's finding it, you're good. It's not your time. <laughs> what are these enemies doing? Here's it. I love counters. <laughs> so good. I think the counter may be a little bit too high. 50% chances. Pretty damn good. Hi, friends. It's a little delayed of the laser beams, I suppose, but it's not bad. <laughs> Actually, I might die. Bro, no eyes. Alright, we're good. <laughs> Didn't realize how low on health he was. Got a pedal. It's a pedal. It's a key item. No description, it's just a pedal. <laughs> Alright. Oh, well, either way, we gotta heal. Let's get everyone. Where am I, seriously? So, dinosaurs, obviously, but. Can you believe this all started with us just wanting to go to a fair? And then suddenly we're in 65 million BC. With the dinosaurs and everything. Crazy times. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> but also... I get that. I don't think I can. So I came from there. Forest maze. Maybe I'll hold off on that. <laughs> Ayoka hut. All right, let's check out the hut. Are uh, you rep reptite friend? I beat you up. Reptite scales cold blood hard to beat. Drink happy water, drink feel good. I 
I believe you. Oh, okay. Thank you. Uh, Ilka Hut. You were, you were funny skins. Thanks. You want to see pretty stone? Redstone, Chief has. Chief Hut, North Village. Okay. That's a chief. All right, let's check this one first. What do we got? Uh, lightning stun dinosaur, you know? I know now. You strange, have good stuff? No, chief say no okay. No can trade. Oh, okay. Go hunt hunting range, get petal fang horn feather. When rain, rare monster comes out? Rare one good hunt. Wait, what? Whoa. whoa, whoa. Go hunt hunting range. Get a petal fang horn feather. When rain, monster, rare monster comes out. Rare one good hunt. I have petals. I have a petal and I have a so I need a feather and then the other thing I don't remember. <laughs> petal fang horn feather. Okay, so I need a fang and a feather. This trade house, you bring things, trade things. Trade, trade your shiny stone. Okay, so people in 65 million BC at least knew how to make potions and a way to heal status ailments. Um, but that's about it. Y'all want to find out what a titanium vest is? <laughs> Just saved your whole lives. Change the feature. All right. Eating grounds. All right, let's go to the chief's hut. Seems kind of important to go here. If I guess he was here. Could be at the meeting grounds. Strong person become chief, man, woman, boy, no matter. Ioka chief, big muscle. We come from mountain, strange mountain, strange thing happened. Now why mystic mountain? Laruba clan hide in the north woods, always hide, run from reptites. They weak. <laughs> they weak. Uh, we fight reptites, La Ruba clan, no fight reptites. La Ruba clan call dactyle. Fly in sky, we can no call. No can fly. So a dinosaur that flies. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, excuse me. Uh, where are you from? Why are you here? Kino no like you. Nice to meet you, Kino. Guess you're not the chief. Thank you for the master chief. Thank you very much. Ah, here. So where is everyone? I need to go talk to. Dactyle nest. I wonder if I need to go to the dactyle nest first before oh hunting range. Before anything else. <laughs> Thanks, number. I do actually feel very tired tonight. <laughs> I might actually wrap early. Not yet. Like, what time is it? Not yet. But I think shortly. <laughs> I just kind of want to figure out what's... Where's the chief? There's a couple things. There's a maze, which I don't think I can... Do. I'll say go talk to the chief who has a red stone. Okay. You have to prove it to the chief. Like I have to go fight the dactyle, maybe. I think Ranger, I don't think I can do yet. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Let's save. 
I will go check that out. That was a thing. That is that. All right, that's happening. Shock about some lightning. Burn a little bit, maybe. It's official. What's well, official mistake? You have to play Chrono Cross now. I know. No, trust me, I know. I mean, don't get me wrong, the plan was already to play it. I think, eventually? I didn't think it was going to come out so soon. The Pony into the Switch just free. I know. I saw that and I was like, the timing on this is insane. Just thinking about it, I was like, wow, really? Already? Well, not already, but I'm just like, I did not expect that so soon. Like, I, I won't lie, I did hear rumors about it, but I was like, you always hear those rumors. For these type of games. <laughs> like I hear for, I don't know, Legend of Dragoon, or Skies of Arcadia, or like any other JRPG. Like, you hear rumors about it all the time. So you're kind of just like, whatever. <laughs> then it actually happens, you're like, oh, fuck. Alright, so I have a fang. So I need a feather. And rain. <laughs> Uh, Mr. Bowser literally called me right before the reveal and was like, Hey, your BFF Jeff Bezos said he's doing your pal BRE a solid drop and crown across. Don't tell anyone. Wow, damn. Get the inside scoop. Respect. Uh, I do also want to let you know I once again had lentil uh, yesterday for lunch. Uh, that was very fulfilling. I just thought I'd let you know that. Uh, it was good lentil. It's like picking me up and dropping me. What the hell, man? <laughs> I just attack. Yeah, it works. <laughs> oh, we got a feather. Alright, so we're good. Now we just need rain. If rumors can become true, then let me start spreading some. Okay, let's start with the rumor. Ocarina of Time is getting yeah, another remaster. <laughs> or that one for a couple of years. <laughs> Actually, no, I heard it was gonna be like a port of the 3DS version. But in HD. I think that was the rumor I heard. And then nothing happened. And then there's the rumor of Ocarina of Time slash Twilight Princess slash Wind Waker being imported to Switch, which also has not happened. <laughs> I feel like they have that point in like their back pocket and you just come out any time. I really hope they don't. I, don't know, I just feel like they poured Ocarina of Time so much. Like, you can play Ocarina of Time on almost literally any modern, like, more recent Nintendo console. Like, 64 can play it. GameCube can actually play it. Wii can play it. It was on the Wii U. Now it's on the Switch. It's on the DS. Play it on your khaki. Like, you can play in so many, so many devices. Even on your PS Vitas. Like so many devices. Sure, you can play on like your Xbox Series S's. So many. But here's the deal though what type of calculator are we talking? Like, we talking like Texas Instrument? Or are we talking, I don't know, Casio? Like, I feel like it's only gonna run on particular type of calculators, you know? 
Uh, any bangers in the Direculate? There was a few. Uh, I can honestly say Mario Strikers, I'm very excited for. I think I might get that day one. Because <laughs> I love, I did enjoy uh, Mario Strikers in the Wii. What was the Wii? Yeah. So I think Robo's dead. Oh, Robo's good. Cure yourself. Mario Shaker was good. Switch Sports was pretty good. I think I'm a little interested in. Um, she can't beat up badly. Just get ahead of it. <laughs> oh, crap, I was dead again. Uh, I just gotta kill one of these enemies, and I feel like I can kind of just get going. <laughs> Strikers? Yeah. TI-84, I already had a Mario and Zelda game that distracts me on. <laughs> can I get the opportunity? Yes, I can. <laughs> Might be too late, though. Come on, Robo. I'm hyped for Mario Kart DLC. Sure, it's not a new game. I'm actually very... Th I actually... I might be in the minority here. Uh, I'm more thrilled for 48 tracks over a new game. Like, don't get me wrong. I think I do want a new game eventually. <laughs> But I'm 100% okay with just what we're getting. Like, 48 tracks is, like, it's pretty much like a new game. But so many. Yeah, still remaking tracks. I'm on the edge of my seat waiting for Mario Kart 9, so I don't have an issue. I wonder if I went on my own. Yeah. I mean, it's also only like, what, 20 bucks? <laughs> or 30 bucks, I think? It's not like extremely expensive. Also, these monkeys will not die. I guess they're kind of like Wizard of Oz like? Winged monkeys with antlers. <laughs> exactly. Trying to fuck. Fuck, actually, you seriously fuck. How am I almost dead? I'm dead. What was that? <laughs> Is resume bookmark game? Alright. I figure why I had so much problems. Uh, and go new tracks. <laughs> Stick. Twenty five doll hairs for forty eight tracks. Frick. Take a number. <laughs> All right, so it's like what five minutes? I'll keep an eye on it. What, what time is it? Is it 25 per? Yeah, I think it's just 25 for all of them. And then if you have the expansion pack, you get them all for free. Kirby's a day one grab. There were a few other dope looking titles. Live 
Live Alive because I'm a suck for anything. Actually, that one I think is like... Might be my underrated one. Is Live... I looked it up afterwards. I didn't realize how well received Live Alive was. And apparently that game, like music wise, was like inspired by uh, Toby Fox, which I had no idea about. <laughs> And apparently he had like the same composer from pretty much any other game you can think of. <laughs> like Kingdom Hearts and Final Fantasies and all that jazz. Yoko. What's her face? Shimo. She did like the whole thing for that game. So I was like, damn. It's like one of those like really hidden gems and they're just like, here you go. <laughs> like, all right, I'll give it a try. Kirby looks so dang good. Glad they were putting so much effort into the game. I actually... I, Kirby Odyssey, it's gonna be good. <laughs> I'm excited for Kirby Odyssey. At 25 for all, but they're releasing eight at a time from March until, yeah. Which I think I'm fine with too, because that's a lot of tracks. Eight at a time? But you think about it, that's a lot. <laughs> so you, they're giving you two Grand Prix at a time. I'm trying to see if I need to go down. I need to go up. All right, let me just make sure I'm healed or not. Risking this. Or no, I'm just being reckless. I think it's good to take the rock out first. Yes, I set the rock. Honestly though, I thought Mark was gonna happen. Years ago, surprised it took Nintendo so long to monetize on the best selling game. Seriously. It's going to make Friendship Cup a lot easier. More Friendship Cup. I'm terrified to be playing a remastered version of uh, Choco Mountain. So I dreaded that, uh. map when I was a kid. I'm asleep. Yep, that wave just never works. I'm just gonna, yeah. <laughs> I'll keep that wave. Or like cup. <laughs> or like friendship. <laughs> Bye. Trying to get my heels in really quick. There were a couple of cups I saw that I was just like, damn, this looks good. Coconut Mall? That's a classic. I did see a lot of them that were getting ported were from the mobile. So to me, I feel like that's gonna feel new because I've never played. My friends and I used to run through... Oh, it's all talking. <laughs> How did I lose that? I got Fang at least. Right. Probable level increased. Sounds like it's my cue to potentially... Crap. Hold up. So I, got, I, got, I, got, I got a thing at my door. What's up, dog? My friends and I used to run through each Mario Kart game tally and wins. Yeah, a trophy that got passed around. That's actually really cool. Jumping around system system. It's cool. Beans court. I think meaning Alola. Possibly. She wants to go out. <laughs> get the screen actually up more. It's okay. I 
the other one. Say the mistake, draft number. <laughs> you just waking up, aren't you? <laughs> hey there. What is up? Stop. She just waking up. <laughs> I can kind of tell. I was like, hey. I think he's waving at you. Just gonna. <laughs> he's just like, I'm just tired, man. Just take me out. <laughs> you alright? Yeah, you sleepy. She's very tired. <laughs> alright, I think what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna actually bookmark this, probably save it, and then wrap. She's a little tired. I'm actually a little tired myself. <laughs> I think I might wrap a little early today. You really want to go? Alright, let's go take you out. Alright. Wanna say bye there, bro? Bye-bye. <laughs> She's just like, no. I'm just tired. Take me out, human, please. I need to go. Alright. Alright, ready to go? Good bye, -bye. Okay. <laughs> All right, let me put this. Um, Actually, like the bookmark option, so I can just hit resume and continue. All right. Yeah, I think we're gonna wrap here. Thank you all for being here today. I appreciate it.